Happy 4th of July, everybody. Now, we all know and we celebrate that our Declaration of Independence was signed in 1776. But what you may not remember was that the fighting started, the bullets started flying in 1775. And I think on this holiday particularly, it's pertinent to remember, go back and study history, why was the famous shot heard around the world fired? Now, as I'm sure you can imagine, tensions were on the rise between those in the colonies and the crown. But it wasn't taxation without representation that started the war. It wasn't a tea tax that started the war. It wasn't the Boston Massacre that started the war. No, the British crown, they knew, they understood that these tensions were getting hot. So they thought it would be a good idea to go to Lexington and Concord, munitions depots, and take the colonials' firearms so that they could not start a rebellion. Well, our founders, being the freedom-loving radicals that they were, they got wind that the British were going to Lexington and Concord with hopes to take their firearms. And I'm sure, as you can imagine, our founding fathers were not too happy about that. And while it's uncertain who fired the first shot, it is indisputable that the shot heard around the world happened because a tyrant tried to take a free people's firearms. Now, before I go, I want to read to you an excerpt from the Declaration of Independence. That whenever any government becomes destructive to these means, it is the right of the people to alter or abolish it. Now, y'all take care and have a happy and safe 4th of July.